Yellow, does your car make people do this? It stings the nostrils. God, no, it smells like, like a used diaper filled with Indian food. Stay tuned to find out how, how to fix that. I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that today. Stay tuned. Well, if you couldn't guess, yes, we are changing the cabin air filter. And what we need is the CAF 1898P. That is what the Dodge Challenger takes. Not sure what years, I know, I believe it's 15 through 21 is the same as mine. I think it goes all the way back to 2010 with the exact same number, but got this real cheap at AutoZone and I'm gonna show you how to put that in. Let's go ahead and uh, get this hood popped. Okay, now that we got the hood popped, let's find the location of this filter. Now I've never changed the filter in one of these, so this should be real fun. We all get to learn together. So it looks like you got two tabs here. Let me pull this one and this one all while holding the camera. If we look down in there, oop, there we go. You can see right here is the filter. Now, it doesn't look too fun to get out, but let's see how this works. So, all right, okay, you just pull up with your fingers. See how I pulled up on that? Just taking, once you pull up, tug this thing out like this. Yank it out. Oh yeah, that's, uh, looks like a bag of yuck threw up in a bag of yuck. Yeah. Yeah, that's gross. I'm doing this with one hand, so this shows you how freaking simple this really is, so. Let's take a look. Uh, let's see, can you tell I'm a smoker? Hmm, probably it looks like my lungs right now, but hey, that's a whole nother story. Uh, beautiful day out, fellas. Okay, so let's take, I guess it doesn't matter which way is which, uh, airflow. Okay, so airflow, we want this arrow pointing towards the inside because it sucks air from outside into the vehicle. So look for the airflow arrow. We want to go this way with it. All right. Oh, not easy to get down in there. Okay, they got some stupid, yeah, they got a little peg right there, so you gotta go around it. Okay, so it kind of falls in there, so you're gonna have to bend the bottom out and get it to sit back in its home. This is a pain in the butt with my feet. Wait, who, I put that little, this little freaking thing here. What a pain in the butt. Look at that. Thanks, Dodge. Good call. Wow, if you just let go, that thing will fall all the way to the bottom, huh? Okay. Let me keep wrestling with this thing. All right, I'm gonna have to use two hands. Hold on. Okay, you can see we got it down in there. Definitely use two hands. It is a pain in the butt. And when you're done, you just push down here and it clicks, and here, and that clicks. And that will stop your car from smelling like cigarettes and tuna fish or whatever nasty stuff you got in there. So once again, use the CAF 1898P, and it does fit perfectly. Oh, got instructions in there, don't need those. Okay, as you can see, we got the new one in place. So now we just have to take our cover. It's got two tabs there right here on the bottom and then these little guys so you start with the back here push it in clip make sure you got the bottom in do i got the bottom in now i got the bottom in click see there we go all done if you guys have any other videos you'd like to see me make on anything that has to do with these challengers please let me know. You can either leave it in the comment below or reach out to me at mydestroyer1320 at gmail.com and I will uh, make that my next video. Appreciate everyone watching. We'll see you on the next one. Goodbye. Yeah,